Okay, new addition to the inventory. This is 2011 Chevy Suburban LTZ 5.3 automatic 4x4. Uh, as you can see, this thing was hitting the right front. And pretty much messed up everything in the nose. Uh, you got a left side headlight. Put in here's your, uh, here's your motor, the 5.3. Nice run of motor. Okay, all the gingerbread is there. You do got radiation in this thing. There's your air cleaner, radiator bottle, uh, master booster, fuse box, your left side headlight. You got a left side fender there. It's got about a two hours on the uh, rear lip. Okay, there's your left side doors, power window, power lock. Like I said, it's an LTZ, so it's got the chrome package. Here's your left side mirror. It's the black with the chrome. It's got the signal. Uh, light sensitive, power fold. Uh, all that kind of nonsense. Here's your left rear door, power window, power locks, privacy tint. Left side quarter's in good shape. You do have a left rear quarter glass, privacy tint, as you can see. Here's your wheels. They're 20 inch. Okay, you only got the two of them. Two left side wheels, that's it. Rear end, uh, 342 Posi 10 bolt. Uh, all complete with the arms. Okay, here's your left rear tail light. Here's your quarter extension piece. Rear hatch is no good. Uh, you do have the camera, wiper motor. Here's your rear glass, the spoiler with the third brake light. Okay, rear bumper cover is no good, so you got a reinforcement with the built in hitch. Uh, right rear tail light is no good, it's broke. You got a quarter extension right there, nothing on the quarter. Okay. Here's your uh, running boards. You got left and right running boards. These are uh, B V E. Okay. Right rear door is no good. You got an outside handle on chrome, inside in chrome. Here's your right rear door glass, privacy tint. Uh, you also have the uh, window regulator, which is in good shape. Here's your right front door, power window, power locks. Same thing on the mirror. Same as the other one. Right side power with the signal. Uh, chrome cap with the black texture below. Uh, this is a power fold mirrors. Okay. Let's go to the inside. You got the power seat tracks left and right. Okay, these with the lumbar. These are heated and cool seats. Okay, but the seats are no good. So here's your uh, all your manufacturer stickers inside. Okay, here's your radio, it's navigation, CD, all of that. Here's your uh, Heated controls, automatic, working good, CJ2, and just the buttons are one, like usual on these things. Okay, inside rear view, it's got the OnStar. Okay. He goes back up. <laughs> Some of my friends going by. Alright, let's go around to the front, and we'll go on the inside of this thing. This thing does got uh, third row seats, uh, black leather. Okay, there's the third row seats, second row, second row seats, okay, there's your second row buckets left and right, black interior of this thing is, uh, trim code is 196, okay, Sorry. Here's your uh, power window switches. Let's go with the power fold. There's your uh, seats, the heated with the cool memory. Okay. Four by four switch. There's your automatic uh, headlights with the dome and the fogs. There is your cluster. It's all good. It was tested. Okay. Steering column, tilt, cruise delay. This thing's got no key. You do have the sunroof, okay, right there is your sunroof, as you can see, okay, this thing does have a power lift gate, uh, both uh, visors are good, they the uh, illuminated, or light up, whatever you want to call them, whatever sounds better, they do a slide out, windshield's in good shape, you do have the back glass, it's a heated privacy tint. Also got a rear wiper. Okay. 
pretty much it on this thing. So, again, 2011 Chevy Suburban LTZ model, 5.3 automatic, 4x4. Uh, as you can see, the thing was hit. Basically in the right front, also in the roof. I think I told you that before, but you can see up there up on the top. The uh, right rear of the roof is all caved in. Broke the quarter glass. The wheels are no good. And that's pretty much it. So if you need any parts of this thing, you can give us a call at 888-748-5924. You ask from old Larry or Curly. Any one of us will be glad to help you with any parts from this or maybe anything else you may need. The business hours here is Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Uh, give us a call about Saturdays because uh, some Saturdays were closed. We may be closing for good on Saturdays. But give us a call on Friday. We'll let you know. Uh, if you can't get us during business hours, you can get us uh, on the internet at allamericanautorecords.com. That's seven days a week, 25 hours a day, 365. That's it. You're ready. One more to do, and we're caught up. Take care. Be safe. Ciao.